Hello there everyone, guys, we're currently seeing some downside over on Bitcoin and we actually went as low as 27,000 and a half. And what am I personally expecting right now? What am I doing with my trade and why am I very, very disappointed in what I'm seeing right now that actually they might go after Bitcoin and try to put it in the ground for good. So this is one of the most important videos of my whole YouTube channel. So make sure to watch it from the beginning and until the end. And certainly quick reminder, we're going to get back to the chart and we're going to talk about it. Uh, but quick reminder about all the things that we're actually seeing. It was that right now, actually, we're seeing that right here that the change that has hasn't happened in the last hundred years is potentially com coming and we are driving this change together. This was again, well, I spoke about this in my previous video. If you haven't seen it, please, here is the link to it. Go and check it out. Just quick reminder. Uh, Russia, Asia, Africa, and Latin, Latin America to use Chinese yuan to settle trade instead of US dollar. So US dollar is starting to lose the dominance. And we've seen this graph right here as well, the new order, the rise of new reserve currency, then the top, then the decline, printing of money, internal conflict, loss of reserve currency, what we're starting to see right now, weak leadership, we're already seeing this, and then civil war and revolution. So, and actually, again, US dollar has been a reserve currency for 94 years, and usually the reserve, as any fiat currency out there lasts up to 110 years, as with Spain in 1500s and 1600s. So, is the dollar a at the end right now and what is the craziest part is this right here but before i tell you guys i have a huge announcement to make and that is that right now there is a huge easter egg hunt up to 80 percent off on my university grade trading education so if you were looking to become one of my students at my certified and accredited trading learning programs then right now is your chance to do so with up to an 80 percent discount so how to do this i've hidden a hidden secret promo code all over my social media in different descriptions of videos and also on instagram and twitter in different tweets and stuff so there are hidden promo codes first 10 people to find one of those promo codes and go to and go to thomascrawlo.com to claim that promo code will get at uh, the first 10 people will get 80 percent discount the next 10 people will get a 70 percent discount on really any program out there um, that you want and also the next 10 people will get a 60 percent discount and then the remainder of people will be getting a 50 percent discount so this is going to last for only a couple of days and certainly these for the uh, first 30 seats with an up to 80 percent discount at, um, at my certified and accredited trading uh, five months long trading learning programs will sell out like this so may, maybe you even want to post this video right now go find a promo code and go directly to thomascrawlo.com to redeem it because this is an opportunity of a lifetime and we will not do one of these probably ever again so right now is your chance it's a five months long trading learning program where you learn everything from active trading to long term uh, portfolio building and you learn how to actually manage your trades like a G, like I have right here, $73,000 in profits. If you want to see these kinds of profits on your side, you want to become one of my students and learn trading psychology, trading statistics, trading algorithms, and all the things that surround trading, because trading is much more complicated than just wedges and key market levels. There are so many things to it, and my learning program is one of the best out there in the world, and by far one of the most affordable ones. So, and right now, with an up to 80% discount, this is your chance to shine. So go claim one of those, uh, find one of those promo codes and become one of my students right now and I'll see you on board. Okay, so let's move on uh, because we've seen this, we've spoken about this. Now, let's talk about this because this is what is a huge disappointment for me, to be honest. The, because we've seen the economic report of the president come out the other week. And it is, what is the economic uh, report of the president? It is an annual report written by the chair of the Council of Economic Advisors, an important vehicle for presenting the administration's domestic and, inter and international economic policies. It provides an overview of the nation's economic progress with the text and extensive data uh, appendices. So now, what is this? So right here, it's actually 500 pages long. If you want to find it, you can actually Google it and you'll find it if you want to read the whole thing. But what I want to talk to you about in this video is chapter eight, and this is the G digital assets. And they actually did a huge chapter on cryptocurrencies. And quite frankly, just to summarize it real quick, because it took me a lot of time reading through this, just to summarize it, what they said is that crypto is unreliable. It's very risky. It requires crazy regulation. It cannot be trusted. It carries no value, blah, blah, blah you know all this elizabeth warren kind of talk so therefore the biden's administration is anti-crypto you could say this they hate crypto they hate the system that it provides and certainly understanding right now that the dollar potentially is about to start losing its global reserve currency status 
they cannot take any risks that's why this is a direct attack and a choke point operation choke point 2.0 that we are seeing right now so uh is this a bad thing so why am i disappointed let me explain watch this video till the end guys very important why am i upset about this is that because the united states is gonna stifle innovation that the united states i lived in us for many years for the better part of my youth i grew up in the united states you could say so and for me i always loved it but and it always has been about innovation but right now they're just being purely stupid because guess what's gonna happen do you think really that we're gonna see so many people you know say oh you know united states is banning bitcoin so how about we just give up on bitcoin no that's not gonna be the case why and this is what is most important right now what we're seeing as us because of this whole situation with the dollar we are seeing hong kong and china taking the lead on this remember we're gonna get through all of this hong kong is charting its own web3 path despite china's anti-crypto stance remember hong kong is opening up to crypto and in june as early as june institutionals will be able to join chinese institutionals will be able to join the crypto scene and then retailers will follow suit as well and right now the chinese nationals are sitting at a 2.4 trillion dollars in savings just personal savings and the chinese pump so to speak is the degen pump and imagine Imagine 2.4 trillion dollars. I mean, it's crazy. So also, Russia currently touts common digital currency between Russia, China, and India. So they're currently also thinking about these kinds of solutions. Next thing, China state-owned banks turn crypto-friendly in Hong Kong, according to Bloomberg. So now imagine right so us is just uh removing the off ramps you know killing all these bank signatures silicon whatever all the banks that were actually servicing majority of the banks that were servicing crypto now uh china is actually coming out and they're like this is exactly what i told you so many months ago and i said if us is gonna try to ban bitcoin china is gonna be like Woo, you've banned bitcoin hello come come please we will be more than happy to welcome a multi-trillion dollar industry and this is what we're currently seeing guys leading chinese banks support hong kong based crypto firms so read this i mean wake up read this so u.s crackdown this is what uh, this said i mean and i completely agree with this article that the u.s crackdown will push crypto center of gravity to hong kong as simple as that and remember a lot of you will say in the comments thomas but you know what if uh you know united states will ban crypto it's all gonna go down blah, 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 and they might try to and short term in the short term perspective there might be some volatility to the downside but remember what do you have to remember is that bitcoin follows global liquidity it doesn't follow just the united states liquidity so it follows global liquidity because it cannot be banned it's decentralized it's true proprietary rights it's actual real permissionless ultrasound money so what we're currently seeing right here this is blue this is actually the global liquidity and red or uh, brown is actually bitcoin so whenever we have a huge global liquidity going up bitcoin is going up so and what are we seeing right now us is starting to inject liquidity because of the banking collapse hello then we're seeing that china is starting to inject liquidity and so is japan so therefore there is no reason for bitcoin and we're going to get to the short um, in just a second not to climb but it just sucks that the us is going to try to protect their colonial garbage monetary system and therefore stifle innovation and potentially bad bitcoin but even if this happens guys what i'm trying to say trust me bitcoin is like water it will find its way to its prime and this is already happening because china is huge and once it's once it opens up to crypto and it will who cares about the united states to be honest the united states is going to be the losers who will lose out and miss out on this huge market in my opinion so now let's move on to the chart and let's discuss as to what is happening in a chart and we've seen a little bit of a downside uh, if we get especially if we're going to go to a 15 minute chart and you know it kind of looks like oh wow thomas you know a lot of people you know they don't know how to zoom out that's why again claim one of those up to 80 percent discount on my trading education because it's a life-changing trading education you learn how to use the lens and how to understand as to what is happening in a market a lot of people are going to say oh you know it lost 3.4 percent like this whole drop in 15 minute chart looks huge but it looks it, it's it's absolutely it's very small if we're gonna go to a daily chart we currently have the most important support right now for us actually we are breaking yes unfortunately for now even then but it seems like it's creating a wick but it's it seems like we are breaking this purple support which is what i said is going to be very important for us because we stood above it of this whole wedge but if we, if we're gonna close in about what in the daily chart or let's take a look in the four hour chart would it actually close but number one look at the volume there is no volume so it's quite small it's, it could potentially just turn out to be a part of this 
move in general and certainly look at most important support because we're so far away like main support currently is about twenty five thousand dollars twenty five and a half this is where if we can actually break below here this is where you know i would maybe get worried because this would you know put us back into this bearish momentum of us actually staying below the daily ema ribbon you know we always uh, in these massive collapses we always predominantly stayed below the daily EMA ribbon and right now we are very bullish because finally here starting from here we finally broke above the daily EMA ribbon and we actually retested it here and we're staying above it for now so therefore it is actually still good looking in my opinion it's the target still remains at about 30,000 bucks and my that's why my trade is still open over on Bybit and again if you want to claim up to $30,000 in initial deposit bonuses then use my link down in the description of this video to buy a bit and claim up to $30,000 initial deposit bonuses so for now guys i would stay very cool and relaxed because certainly united states and biden's administration and then hopefully maybe republicans would win in even though i'm apolitical but who knows if republicans win in 2024 this would be actually bullish for bitcoin because democrats are the ones who are trying to stifle innovation and actually choke crypto right now even though republicans in many states like florida for example are very pro bitcoin and cryptocurrency so a win of republicans would actually give us upside potentially in my personal humble opinion in terms of regulation in the united states and guys once again quick reminder if you want up to an 80 percent discount on my famous certified trading education uh, where you actually get a certified diploma at the end of your studies after your final exam then go ahead and start hunting for those promo codes immediately and claim those at thomascrawlo.com directly on the product that you would like and as always peace and love thomas Crawlo. stay smart stay rich and i'll see you next video Bye bye